The first suspect I'm going to talk about was arrested after police reportedly seized heroin from him. He was in a vehicle at a retail store here in Hickory. 24 year old Garrett Nicholas Oaks of Brook South Drive in Hickory was arrested by Hickory police at about 530 PM Thursday on one felony count of possession of Schedule One controlled substance and one misdemeanor count of possession of drug paraphernalia. Oaks was arrested after Hickory police responded to reports of a suspicious person in a vehicle at a retail store on Catawba Valley Boulevard Southeast in Hickory. Upon arrival, officers found 0.83 grams of heroin in Oaks possession, according to police reports. The suspect was taken into custody and was placed in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $2,500 secured bond. He has since been released. The district court appearance is scheduled for November 19th. The next suspect faces a pair of assault charges following an arrest late last week here in Hickory. 51 year old Charles William Coker of 18th Avenue Northeast in Hickory was arrested by Hickory police at 525 PM Thursday on one felony count of assault inflicting serious injury and one misdemeanor count of assault with a deadly weapon. The suspect was arrested when Hickory police responded to Coker's residence in reference to a domestic assault involving a father and son. The father, Charles William Coker, was taken into custody without incident at the scene. He was in possession of a lethal cutting instrument at the time of his arrest, according to police reports. Coker was processed at the Hickory Police Department and was released under a $2,000 unsecured bond. He has a district court appearance scheduled for November 9th. Reporting from Hickory for WHKY-TV News, I'm Rob Eastwood. Back to you.